Dani full charge wae mashariki na tunakisha kwamba tunakupa burudani ya ina yake ndio mwanzo tu tumeanza kabisa mm hebu cheki dondo za story ambazo zime trend Africa mashariki toka hivi tunaanza na Mina Ali all the way from 255 Wai Mashariki, mimi naitwa Mina Ali na hii ya leo ndiyo Dondo. Kazi yangu ni kila Jumatatu kuja hapa kukupa updates Tanzania kumetokea nini na nani walifanya nini wapi sehemu gani nao. Uh, this week kati ya updates ambazo niko nazo mzungumzaji wa timu ya Simba. Najua kwa Kenya labda timu zenu kubwa zinaweza sikaa ni Gor Mahia ama timu tim kama hizo. Na huku Tanzania kuna Simba na Yanga ambazo ni timu kubwa 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 mno na ni timu pinzani. Sasa mzungumzaji wa timu ya Simba ambaye ni maarufu na amejijengea umaarufu sana sana kwa comments zake jana usiku alikuwa na party ama alikuwa na birthday party ambapo alikuwa anazindua perfume yake mpya. Yes, anaitwa Haji Manara. Na ni occasion ama ni sehemu ambayo wasanii na watu wakubwa wakubwa walijitokeza eh, kuelekea pale. Moja kati ya watu wakubwa sana ambao walitokezea ama walikuwa pale kwa red carpet ni pamoja na Diamond na Sheme wifi yetu <laughs> Tanasha. Ndugu yenu nyinyi sasa hapo. Mhm, mm unaona? Video hii imechukuliwa na Bongo 5. Basi Bale hapo bwana wakati perfume inaanza kuonyeshwa sasa wakaambiwa watu wainunue kwa pesa ambazo ni kwa gharama kubwa zaidi kwa ajili ya kusaidia uh, watu wenye ulemavu wa ngozi nchini Tanzania eh, kwa almarufu kama zero zero. So kila mtu akawa anatoa kwa timu ya Diamond uh, na WCB wasafi wenyewe walisema watatoa watachangia watainunua perfume hiyo kwa shilingi milioni sita. Lakini on the other hand alikuwepo mama la mama shishi baby shilole msanii wa Tanzania na mwigizaji pia lakini vile vile mtu ambaye ameingia kwenye trend nyingi 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 sana kwa Kiingereza chake. Na wakati watu wananyanyua mkono na yeye akanyanyua akasema mimi nitatoa nitainunua perfume kwa shilingi 100. Najua Kenya mia ni kama shilingi mia moja ya Kenya ni kama shilingi elfu nne za Tanzania lakini mia ya Tanzania ni pesa ya kununulia pipi tu so kumbe usichokielewa ni kwamba Shilole alikuwa anakusudia kusema 100,000 Tanzanian shillings lakini Kiingereza kikampiga chenga alifanywa maujiano na Bongo 5 haya hapa mtizao nilikuwa nje kataja 100 badala 100,000 mbele ya ubati wa watu tayari tunamzungumzia Haji Manara ameshazindua perfume yake na hapa mbele yangu naye Shilole lakini Shilole leo aliacha umati ucheke ama kwa kununua perfume kwa shilingi 100 <laughs> yani kiingereza kilijua kwa mkuja kujivuruga ndio nikaa nimetaja 100 nikajua ni 100 kumbe ni shilingi 100 lakini nimeelekebisha kwa Kiswahili kama moja ameelewa au huko kuniela au unyenyewe 100 nikasema ni yani watu watu akawa wamecheka sasa hivi ni sawa lakini si ni hela mimi nilikuwa nimezamia 100 mambo 100 mimi kwa kweli nikizungu wiki ndio maana nasimaga spendi basi tu na kipenda kizungu lakini chenye yake ni pendi but why jamani Mi nikuwa ni mamanisha laki moja. Hivi niambia 100 ishi na ituaji. Sema, sema ukweli. Sema wewe. 100,000. Eh, hey, ahani, kume nitekiwa nisema 100,000. 100,000 naira. In Tanzania shilling. Naira. Ah, shilling man Tanzania. Monday and we are back on Dondo only on Y Mashariki. My name is Kalendu Musimi here to give you the most exclusive celebrity news from Uganda all the way from the 256 and of course two
weeks ago, I told you about Jackie Chandiru and her rebranding herself and getting back into the music industry. She has managed to convince Leon Island Empire CEO Jose Chameleon to get into her track, which is called Wine It. Wine It is a dancehall track that is set to be released soon, and of course, it is also a club banger, and we cannot wait for this song. This is after three years of Jackie Chandiru's absenteeism of a drug addiction. Well, let's hope that fans are going to fall in love with her again. While Jackie Chandiru is rebranding herself, Bobby Wine, on the other hand, is making moves. Well, he was in Jamaica last weekend where he met legendary artist Buju Banton, who was recently released from jail after seven years in custody. And of course, he also met Capleton and the Prime Minister of Jamaica. Um, here in Jamaica, you performed on Rebel Salute. Yeah. How did that feel like for you? Was this the first time you were performing in Jamaica? Yeah, yeah. All right, it was, so talk uh, it was to me my Bobby. second time to come to Jamaica, yeah. but it was my first time to perform yeah. on such a show. It was humbling, man. I've been watching Rebel Salute from very many years, yeah. you know, with my friends. And uh, the first time I received a call from Tony Rebo telling me I'm going to perform, uh, I, uh, he was inviting me to perform on the Rebel Salute. Mm -hmm. I must say I was humbled. And when I came, I believe that I came with all the wishes and all the blessings of my friends back home and the ancestors. And so stepping on that st stage was overwhelming, one. And two, it's because it was a special opportunity for me uh, because currently my music has been abolished back home and my stage uh, performances have been banned. But the people want to hear me. So for the people, the millions back home watching me on their phones, live on Facebook mm -hmm. and on YouTube, performing to them was another assurance that the music cannot be stopped. And this time round, uh, let's just hope that he's gonna do Caribbean music. And fans are expecting that he has already organized collabs with the legends themselves. Please, Bobby One, don't let us down. Well, that's all we had for you today, all the way from Uganda. My name is Kalondu Mosimi. Do follow me on Instagram at Kalondu underscore Mosimi. See you later. Another day, another time. Uki cheki mtazamaji niko katika mandhari flani vya mezi, mandhari flani fresh, mandhari flani tamu, kwa jile miku kupa story tamu. Nikisema mogu bado, simi kwamba mambo bado ajafika kukufamisha. Lakini na manisha kwamba, nikibao cha msajigo na kama Yvonne Dark. Alitua kibao kama mizimine leopita mambo bado, mbado kunaitaji kufama mambo mengine bado ajafanyika. Sababu gani? Katika mtandao kiki jamii, sijiona japosti chochote. Mwisho wali uche posti ilikuwa kama januari tariku minanani, bakalea wa japosti. Lakini meza kutafuta mawaj Kitu ambacho nataka ufahamu kuhusiana na Ivan Duck ni kwamba tunafahamu alingia kimapenzi na mfokaji hivi wa hapa Kenya Christoph ambaye anatama na kibao kama Dundai na vile vile kitu ambacho unahitaji kufahamu pia kuhusu Ivan Duck ni kwamba Ivan Duck kando na kusupport wasanii kwa sababu tunafahamu yeye kwamba ni mmoja wa majaji katika kipindi fulani kilichojitokeza katika runinga fulani ambapo stayetaja kwa sasa lakini Ivan Duck ameweza kupata kwa mara ya pili nafasi ya kuwa jaji na kando na kuwa jaji wa kusupport wasanii katika muziki vile vile pia ni kama anaanzisha kipindi chake ambacho kitakuwa kinakuja hivi karibuni jasema ni runinga gani lakini utakuwa unafahamu hebu sikiza moja na moja moja ambayo nilikuwa nayo naye Duck niko poa uko mzima kabisa uh, mwanzo ongera sana kwa kukua kwa mara ya pili nona umekua katika I can sing when kama jaji Aha uh -huh. uh, Umechukulia aje hiyo Ani mefrae of course Nam Ina nifraisha sana juu tulianza nao ni kama mtoto sasa yangu Ni kama mtoto wangu sasa Nam Naelewa Nam Tulianza nao na this time round talent iko nyingi sana inatuanesha Kenya kuna masauti nyingi kuna very talented artist Nam Wako upcoming na pia wengine wako underground so hii ni platform zuri Nam Kuwatolea kwa industry Nam Mm. E, tukiangalia kando na Yvonne Duck support wa sani kuna, kuna abari ambazo zimenifikia mimi mm. Kwa mba Yvonne Duck pia na support wa igizaji Na kuna kipindi ambacho toko na kujanya cho siri Sambo itakuwa na shuti wa Mombasa Eh, sijua isikia yu <laughs> Ilikuwa na sikia kutoko na auditions kama ilikuwa jumamosi na dhani Auditions da, I can sing Na hapa na za siri sambo na ianda Eh, sijua isikia kusu yu Kuna mtu ameni approach na yu Kwa wakwe mtu ameme kuwa approach Kando na series pia kuna kipindi ambacho pia unakifanya ambacho kinajulikana kama jina ni menipote ya kidogo mm. Lakini ni kipindi ambacho unawoji masta Maybe, sijui, pengine wana, wana plan kuni approach, sijui, ijenifikia bado Oe, ya kufikia mm. Lakini katokea utakua unaifanya hivi karibuni Of course, siyezi kosa Oe, siyezi kosa Kine wana, siyezi 
kukusha Hawezi kwa saa kukuja Kazi ni kazi Kazi ni kazi Kanda unailo ukukaribu na shemeji yama Shemeji nani? Ndugi yetu Christoph Siko na yeye Oh yuko salama lakini Ajua uh, mara mwisho na mimi nafahamu kwamba eh nilikuwa na nilikuwa nasikia kwamba kuna kitu kinaendelea kati yako na Christoph. Ah uh, sio ngange kuhusu my personal life. Owezo wezo mzata kidogo tu kwa ile faida ya mtazamaji. Sio ngange kuhusu my personal life. Oh ngange kuhusu personal life yako. Mm. Kwa tumefurahi tumezungumza na wewe. Uh-huh. Na tunakutakia kila laheri pia na shemeji tunamtakia kila laheri. Uh-huh. Na tunatarajia makubwa kutoka kwako. Uh, shukran sana kwa muda wako na kuwa na jioni njema. No problem. Je, kana una Ivon Duck kuna Brown Mouse? Inakuwaje mpenzi mtazamaji umetazama dondoo kali dondoo za kijanja jonjo ambazo uzipati pengine popote ile kupita katika kipindi cha Wai Mashariki hapa ndani ya Wai 254. Umesikiza kutoka kwa Minali plus 255 akisho na 